I'm gonna do one more final update uh, on the blackberries. Here it is, June the 12th, uh, my daughter's birthday, actually. And I'm just gonna let you look at them one more time, uh, real quickly. Um, but they're doing better. They're still putting out more laterals as they put laterals out. They're putting out more ber berries. And I've learned firsthand, hey, the more laterals, the more berries you're gonna get. So you might well keep them cut back in, in a way where you're gonna get more lateral. So that's just something I learned. Um, it, it was something I saw happening on some of the berries. Some of them have a little white spots in them, uh, like that one. And uh, it will never get black. It would just, you know, um, get the berry get dark and it just be a little white spot in it. So if anybody knows why it's doing that, what I need to be doing, if, it's get, if I'm doing too much, uh, fertilizing too much or whatever i'd appreciate that but I, one thing i know notice is as the year has gone on they put more berries out i've seen a great decrease in that especially here on the end i don't hardly see any of them doing that little, little white spots in them but I, my my feeling is that as these berries get older because this is just the first year for these berries uh as the years carry on i i, I predict they're going to get better and better the quality going to get better as the root systems on them mature as you can see the new shoots that are coming up for next year a nice big thick lush shoots and uh you know and there's more coming up and i'll be able to cut them back and uh, cut all the old ones back at the end of the uh, fall uh, beginning of the winter so those are some real nice thick shoots so i think the quality are going to get better so i think a lot of the little problems i had with the white spots is just because they knew a new new bed but uh also the this variety here which i believe is apache does seem like it's a little bit bigger so if you're looking for a bigger berry uh you might want to kind of like what you see in the stores you might want to stick with the uh apache variety but most of all these are indian varieties and they pretty much all the same taste the same the other ones get big too that one down the end like it just consistently get big uh, Another thing I'm going to continue to do is put the PD the pine straw under these because that, you know, hadn't deterred them from putting new suckers out and it keeps that soil nice and moist under there and rich. So I pull that back and maybe fertilize them again next year. Once these things get more established, I think they pretty much don't need any. You know, they become self sufficient. Maybe every few years I align them just to make sure the uh, pH stays high. The raspberries need more of a rebound year i think this is their first year too i'm looking for next year to have a real good raspberry year because these raspberry shoots that are put out raspberries next year are real nice and thick and uh whereas the first year they were kind of thin like these right here that these are the second year uh primer cane that was supposed to put fruit out but uh they didn't put any quality fruit out because they were so thin but i think now that they're putting these new thick uh big pretty nice uh laterals out that they'll you know uh, be real nice next year so i'll also show, show show you those next year but uh i'm not gonna let them uh, um show you them going dormant and me cutting them back uh, i'm just gonna come back next summer when they come back out and put berries out and let you see how well they look so Anyway, I appreciate, appreciate you for watching.